All right, so what is ProBuilder or ProGrids? Well, really, instead of what is ProBuilder, maybe we should start with what is ProCore? ProCore is a set of level design tools originally developed by Gabriel Williams and Carl Hinkle. They provided these tools via the Unity Asset Store, giving Unity users the ability to basically model directly in the Unity Editor. Tools like these in Unity was kind of unheard of, yet was a very requested feature. We all flock to this asset and it obviously just works great. Of these tools, there's ProBuilder for 3D modeling. You have ProGrids for accurate snapping your objects within the 3D editor scene. And then you have PolyBrush, which is in beta, but it's for mesh sculpting and painting directly on your 3D meshes right in the editor. So I'm pretty sure already you can tell that these tools are kind of important. In most situations, you would either gray block out your levels using Unity's built-in standard objects like the plane or the cube, and or you would model your scene in another software like Blender or Maya to then import all of that information directly into Unity. See, this process takes a little time, so due to really the collisions, making sure you got the correct scale, and if any of that is incorrect, you would need to kind of make your changes in that outside 3D software to then import that stuff right back into Unity again. This generally would just take up a lot of time. But now with ProCore tools, ProBuilder, ProGrids, and PolyBrush, you can test your character in your scene much more quickly, testing out your layout, testing out the pace, testing out your scale all at once. Also with ProBuilder, the meshes you use are not just for grain blocking. You can actually use these in your final design, adding detail to these meshes right in your editor. You can do materials, you can do whatever you desire. Having ProBuilder and ProGrids and PolyBrush really just makes level design fun. And I wanna thank Carl and Gabriel for making it. And I wanna thank Unity for adding it to the Unity editor. So in our next video, let's take a look at ProBuilder and ProGrids.